Welcome to the learning videos. I am Dr. Achira presenting a case of 42 year old male who came to the center with the complaints of abdominal uh, with the abdominal complaints. Uh, since uh, last 5 years the patient has mild burning and heaviness in the epigastric region. This complaint is better by eating that is better after e better eating after. Also he gets uh, uh, constipation that is uh, the stool is not clear. He was investigated three years back and was found to have H. pyloric infection. Also endoscopic examination was done. In the exo endoscopic examination, it revealed that patient had erosive esophagitis, inflammatory enteral gastritis and erosive duodenitis. He was given the course of antibiotic at that time and patient improved and uh, responded to the treatment but again since last three months he is getting abdominal complaints also in past history he said that 10 years back he was he suffered from jaundice uh, he likes sweets and warm food patient is hot generally and he is um, he has mild nature and very adjustable and cheerful now let us think over the problem uh, it may be uh, it may be because of the recurrence of the infection which is leading to the main complaint that is um, uh, burning and heaviness in the epigastric region which he gets on and off the modality which is here is better eating after but that is common to the um, uh, that is common to the disease so there is no characteristic uh, modality uh, there is no characteristic modality as such also patient likes sweets and warm food a few remedies came up in my mind. Uh, I gave uh, chelidonium was chosen because uh, it has action on GI tract and also there was past history of jaundice. Now we will uh, discuss this case further tomorrow. Thank you. Welcome to the learning videos. I am Dr. Achira presenting yesterday's case of H. pyloric infection. This is the follow up case of H. pyloric infection. After 10 days of chelidonium, when patient came, he said that there was no change in the complaint. Also, he said on subsequent visit that there is distinct increase in the complaint after drinking tea. He also said that he feels sort of internal burning after eating, uh, after drinking tea, especially in the stomach. Taking into the consideration tea aggravation and sensation of heat and better after eating, I gave him Ferrum Fos 200 TDS. He improved partially. At that point, I gave him tuberculin of 1M and uh, that was given a one dose. He improved further. The uh, schedule of Ferrum Fos 200 and then 1M along with the tuberculin of 1M as intercurrent was continued for three months. He was much better. But again after few days, he came with the recurrence of the complaint and he told that this time the trouble has increased. Reference to the repertory was made and Ferrum, for, Ferrum Met also suggested tea aggravation. Also the Ferrum Met covers better eating after. So therefore Ferrum Met 1M and 10M was given intermittently. Uh, he, uh, the complaints were relieved after the Ferrum Met completely. He gets the complaints occasionally now and also with the main complaint he sometimes get burning in the eyes but uh, he responds to sepia as uh, acute followed by ferromet as chronic during the last one and a half year he has mild burning only twice and which was promptly responded to the sepia and also to the ferromet in this case the question is that uh, why not i thought of ferromet in the beginning and i gave him ferrum force but to say the ferrum force was given on loose ground as uh, the same complaints, the same modalities that is better eating after and tea aggravation is covered by ferrum met. Also, the other point to be noted is the control of infection of H. pylori. It appears that homeopathic treatment has uh, arrested the recurrence. So, uh, ferrum met improved this case. Thank you.